Can I teach you how to read an EKG in under one minute with no prior medical knowledge whatsoever? Yes, I can. There are four chambers of the heart, two on top and two on the bottom. Our bodies have a natural pacemaker known as the SA node, and this fires electricity off and tells the right and left atria to squeeze or contract. The atria contracting creates our first little wave known as the P wave. The contraction of these atria is actually pushing blood into the ventricles, but the ventricles don't know to squeeze or contract yet because the electricity is still holding here in this AV node, and it holds electricity because it's giving the atria time to empty the blood into the ventricles. So the time of the AV node holding on to this electrical delay is known as our PR segment, and this PR interval is the start of when the electricity was fired, the atria is contracting contracted and the AV node holds it before the electricity is sent down into the ventricles and tells the ventricles to contract or push blood out of the heart. And this is known as that giant wave we see on the paper known as our QRS complex. This little segment here is the ST segment where the ventricles are recovering from this big contraction. And the last little wave is this T wave. And it's basically when the ventricles are releasing energy and they're just getting ready to do all of this again. If you want to learn more hard medical concepts, this 300 page workbook breaks everything down. It starts very basic and builds all the way up.